All right, today we're playing a game called Dude, Where's My Pitch? It was created by the people that did Valhalla, the cyberpunk bartending simulator, which is still coming. One of these days I'm going to play that game. I just have not got around to it yet. Um, but yeah, let's give it a shot. Dana, ellipses. Iris, ellipses. Dana, how did we end up doing this? I don't even know how we got here. We just woke up in the lobby. What the hell did we do yesterday? I think Monopoly was involved somehow. <laughs> Let's focus on the now. What are we supposed to do here? Wait, there's something scribbled on my hand. Sell them your idea. Go, tiger. Thanks, past me, I guess. Sell them what? I don't know. Just sell them an idea, I guess. Let me start and you follow up. That'll make them think we know what we're doing. Stern man. Girls, we're waiting on you. Right, sorry. Greetings, ladies, and... All right. Oh, sorry. Greetings, gentlemen. We are Dana Zane and, Ir and Iris Ignis. Names, rhyming names, so tired. Okay, click on something to get an idea. Gentleman's magazine, shiny red phone, bald client. Billboard about Adventure Cats movie. TV with milk uh, advertising on loop. All right, well, whiteboard. All right, we're going to do TV with milk advertising on loop. That seems relevant. We're selling here. It's more than a mere idea. We're here to bring you a long-lasting, fat-free idea that'll last longer than any other. An idea that you can apply to everything from desserts to cakes. This idea is one of the best you'll see in the market, and er... Um, well, you see... Adventure Cats. Our idea might sound silly, but it will be appealing. We'll make sure to use that chance to catch up onto the public, and never leave. Your products will be like cats, waiting to pounce on clients. Adventurous cats that fear nothing, except water and maybe plastic bags. Cats are so cute. Er, uh, I mean, adventurous, strong. But before we officially start telling you about our idea, any questions? What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Sorry, I got carried away. Why, yes. Why didn't you bring any material for your pitch? That's well. That's because we're like this blank whiteboard. <laughs> we're just full of possibilities, and while we aren't here to sell you ideas, we're here to take a challenge. We want to make possible any projects that other people left behind. We're looking for a challenge to face. We'll make it possible. We were actually talking about the project in this folder. The guys that offered it got their first payment and disappeared. Do you guys want to try your hand on it? Yeah, we'll do it. All right, then. Give them the folder and let's call it a day. Now what? We burn this folder and never speak about this again. <laughs> I like it. All right, we're doing it again. Here we go. How did we get here? Drunken Monopoly. All right. Here we go. I'm so ready. Okay, girls, we're waiting for you. Right, sorry. Greetings, ladies, and greetings, gentlemen. We are Dana Zane and Iris Ignis, and um... Wait, did I, Bill Clinton lookalike client. I want to do. I want to do. I want to do Bill Clinton lookalike client. Who here remembers the '90s? The '90s were a weird stage for society. The internet is making its first steps and all that, and like the teen stage of the new millennium. It's like the '80s. Once you take off all the awkwardness and silliness, you're left with not that much actually, but there's a lot of charm, and that charm's enough for people. They look back into that era with fond memories. We're here to bring you that charm in a most undiluted way. And, um, we won't try to sell you things that pretend to be classy, when in the end, they're just like the rest. We're different. We cut that trash away. If you buy our idea because you like the centerfold, we'll give you a damn centerfold. We'll give you the centerfold and 10 pages of bikini, even. <laughs> We won't try to make excuses for interviewing some actor about politics. 
<laughs> we won't dress everything else in a padded, classy excuse. You'll have what you paid for. But therefore, we officially start t before we start t officially telling you about our idea, any questions? <laughs> yes. Why didn't you bring any material for your pitch? That's, well, because life's too short to worry about that stuff. We could spend all our time showing graphs and photos, but we don't have time for that, and neither do you. We're getting this because we want to. Because we want to look back and don't have any regrets. If death were to call on that phone, what would you say? There's too much I haven't done yet. Or, I'm too happy with my life to die. She's right. I'm going to do what I want. I'm going to run away with my son's teacher. Oh, God. And start a coffee plantation in Colombia. Screw this. I'm going on a road trip with my dragon kin. See you later, humans. I always thought the idea of a company that makes buttons was silly. Starting tomorrow, Big Red Button Ink will make curtains. Did you just trigger a midlife crisis on three guys? <laughs> yes, I did. Okay, this is cute. I really like it.